right now, me and my mom are outside. Like, literally, I'm outside in the outdoors for the first time in forever. But we are outside, and we have all of this view. Look at it. All this water. All right now, I'm about to paint while my mom... What are you gonna do, mama? She's gonna play on her phone. <laughs> so I'm about to watercolor something. I found this video that I really wanted to try. It's a watercolor painting for beginners because I am definitely a beginner. And it's with Draw with Sheba. He's this really cool artist that I follow. So I'm gonna start this. I have my water bottle from the water that I'm gonna use. And then I have my cup. Let's start painting. Hi guys, so I didn't actually talk while I filmed this. I kind of just got into painting and never said anything else. So I thought I would ask her, answer, ask her, answer, answer some questions for you guys. So the first question is, who is my hero? Um, my hero is probably my dog. <laughs> my dog Saint. He was my hero because he was the best little dog ever in the whole world. Um, and if I could live anywhere, where would it be? Um, definitely Mars. I would love to live on Mars, you know, be the first inhabitant there. Create my own civilization called Jamariville. I've always wanted to do that. Or on my own plot of land. That would be cool. Um, what is my biggest fear? My family being murdered at night. That is my biggest fear. Not even me dying, it's like my family being like murdered. So, that's scary. Um, my favorite family vacation. My family doesn't really go on vacation. Um, so I guess when we went to California, that was fun. <laughs> um, what would you change about yourself if you could? Definitely my attitude, because I have a very bad attitude when it comes to people annoying me so i wish i could work on that but like you know i am who i am so if you make me upset then you'll see you'll see if you make me upset um what makes me really angry people who don't know how to behave they talk out of their butts and are just plain disrespectful it's not okay um what motivates me to work really hard um myself <laughs> I just think about where I would want to be in a year from now, and that's not in the same place, so I work hard to get to somewhere else. Um, why am I talking like this? Do I sound weird? I feel like I sound weird. I don't know. Um, what is the favorite thing about my career? I don't have a career, but if I was going to choose a career, it would want to be a YouTuber. And my favorite thing about that would be I would have full control over anything that I wanted to do. I wouldn't have to ask anybody's permission, which would be amazing. Um, my biggest complaint about my job, I work in retail, so the customers. Ah, oh, they're annoying. Um, my biggest, my proudest accomplishment? Graduating high school. I really didn't think I was going to do that, but I did, surprisingly. Don't know how. Because I failed like three classes. I still don't know how I got out of there, but I did. So thank God. My favorite book to read is definitely Ash Princess, that whole series, or um, the Cinder series. I'll link the books down below because I don't really remember the title of the series. I just know the book name. What makes me laugh the most? Myself, because I'm freaking funny. I'm the most hilarious person in the world, and you will love me when you meet me. <laughs> see <laughs> i'm fun um what was the last movie i went to shoot that was a bit z last oh it was underwater with the Kristen stewart one that one and it was surprising to say the least like you knew who's gonna die first but you did not know who's gonna die last and you were surprised at the end it was like wait a freaking minute what that movie was like all types of messed up but all types of wonderful and i might buy it what did you want to be when i was small i wanted to be a drummer actually i wanted to be a drummer in a band i don't know if that's weird um what does your child want to be when he or she grows up don't have children yet if you could choose anything you'd want to be for a day what would it be a very rich person <laughs> i'd like to be that for a day just to spend my money and not have to worry about not being able to eat that day what is my favorite game or sport to watch and play my favorite sport to watch is definitely soccer and my favorite game is definitely solitaire would you rather ride a bike ride a horse or drive a car drive a car definitely because it's safer i think 
I don't know, you can still die, but like, all right, I'm not gonna go there. What would I sing at karaoke? Sneaker Night by Vanessa Hudgenson. What uh, what two radio stations do you listen to in the car the most? I do not listen to the radio in the car. What sh which would you rather do? Wash the dishes, mow the lawn, clean the bathroom, or vacuum the house? Vacuum the house, it sounds the easiest and less food touching. If you could hire someone to help you, would it be with cleaning, cooking, or yard work? Ooh, I don't care about the yard. I do like to eat cooking, because then they can make me whatever I wanted to make. Um, if you could eat only one meal for the rest of your life, what would it be? Mochi ice cream. <laughs> Who's my favorite author? Definitely Laura Sebastian. I love her. Have you ever had a nickname? What is it? It is actually Jem, which was the surname of this channel. Sincerely Jem. It was the name before Jamari Giovanni. I chose a nickname for myself and it was Jem. Do you like or dislike surprises? I like them because I've never, actually I've never actually been surprised in my life. So I don't know if I like them or not. Um, in the evening, would you rather play a game? game visit a relative watch a movie or read definitely read would you rather vacation in hawaii or alaska hawaii because there's heat would you rather win the lottery or work at the perfect job work at the perfect job because you make more money than you would at the lottery who would you want to be stranded with on a deserted island um my friend mel if money was no object what would you do all day save it and no i would not say it with fly i would buy food definitely if you could go back in time what year would you travel to not 2020 <laughs> heck no and definitely um ooh, when jesus was alive i don't want to go back there even though like black people don't really ooh. Ooh, hold on mm -mm. shoot before racism how about that <laughs> I go there. How would your friends describe you? Rude. What are your hobbies? I like to make YouTube videos. I like to paint. I like to read. I like to plan things. Um, I clean when I'm bored. I like to dance to music. <laughs> what is the best gift you've ever been given? Um, my vlog camera. And what is the worst gift you have received? Um, anything my sperm donor got me. Aside from necessities, what, it, what one thing could you not go a day without? Um... Uh -huh. My fan, my fan, I cannot sleep without my fan. List two pet peeves, people who breathe too loud and people who don't have manners. Where do you see yourself in five years? Uh, moved out, owning my own townhouse and probably having 10 million subscribers on YouTube. And married, maybe, I don't know. How many pairs of shoes do you own? I own six pairs of shoes. If you were a superhero, what powers would you have? The power of knowledge. I would know anything and everything. What would you do if you won the lottery? Give it to charity or send it to a women's shelter. Um, what form of public transport do you do prefer? Air, boat, train, bus, car. Car? Because it's my car. I don't really go on planes. I don't really go on the air that much. I've not really traveled that much in my life. I've been on a ferry, but boats scare me. Um, I've never been on a train unless you count the ones in the airport. I've been on a bus, but they smell bad, so I don't go on those anymore. What is my favorite zoo animal? A otter. If you could go back in time and change one thing, what would it be? Meeting, um, probably being mean in sixth grade. Cause that's when I started being mean to people in order to protect myself because something happened in my other school and I was like, you know what? Let's just be rude to people. But I wish I was like how I used to be because now I can't even remember that girl anymore. Um, if you could share a meal with any four individuals, living or dead, who would it be? My grandma on my mom's side, my dog, um, Mel, <laughs> um, and... Shoot, Jesus. <laughs> How many pillows do you sleep with? Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I sleep with nine pillows. Um, what is the longest you've gone without sleep? Three days, and because I didn't know um, how to stop watching the show I was watching, it was like I binged the whole thing in three days. Um, what is the tallest building you've been to the top in? I've never been to the top of a building, ever okay word um would you rather trade intelligence for looks or looks for intelligence looks for intelligence i don't need to be smart 
<laughs> How often do you buy clothes? Probably once a month. Have you ever had a secret admirer? Heck no. What's your favorite holiday? Um, I don't really have a favorite holiday. Probably Thanksgiving because there's food. What's the most daring you, daring thing you've ever done? I <laughs> freshman year I wrote some a very descriptive note to my science teacher explaining to her what I would do if she made me mad again. So, yeah. What was the last thing you recorded on TV? I don't have a TV. What was the last book you read? Um, Ash Princess by Laura Sebastian. Um, what's your favorite type of foreign food? Tacos. Are you clean or a per- messy person? Definitely a messy person. Would you want to play in a movie of four year of your life? Who would you want to play you in a movie of your life? Dove Cameron. <laughs> How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Um, probably like 20 minutes. Um, what kitchen or appliance do you use every day? A fork. What is your favorite fast food chain? Um, I don't really have one. What is your favorite family recipe? Um, we don't really have one that we use all the time. What it? What's your favorite family tradition? We open Christmas presents every year um, at midnight. What's your favorite movie? Definitely Descendants, all of them. <laughs> I don't care which one. Um, how old were you when you learned Santa wasn't real? How did you find out? Oh, is this a story? So I was probably like five and I guess my sister had woken up and caught my mom um, putting presents under the tree and so she ran back upstairs, shook me awake, told me Santa wasn't real, and then got back in bed. Meanwhile, I was having an emotional breakdown. Um, is your glass half full or half empty? Half empty. What's the craziest thing you've done in the name of love? I don't really love people, so not really anything. What three thing? What three items would you take with you on a deserted island? My phone, water till I die, and food. <laughs> What's your favorite subject in school? I don't like school. What's the most unusual thing you've ever eaten? Unseasoned asparagus disgusting is there anything he'd wish would come back into fashion no (laughs) are you introvert extrovert i'm definitely an introvert and finally do you love or hate roller coasters um i've been i've been on roller coasters so i don't know so there are more questions but i think i'm gonna leave it at that for now guys um if you guys have any more questions please ask me down below and i would love to answer them but uh yeah let's get back to me bramming about my artwork kind of cute. I like it. I think I'm gonna get another brush. Need a smaller one. No. But so far I kind of like it. It's cute. Little sunset. Um, I need another brush though. Camera's getting like really hot so I think I might have to stop this video soon. But I just want to do a quick little video paint with you guys if you guys painted with me comment down below if you guys did i'd really like to know also like if you can dm me on instagram your painting because i love looking at artwork i love that art doesn't have to be perfect you can just paint whatever it's art so you can't say it's bad depends on the eye and i'm gonna keep painting this so but i will see you guys in another video thank you guys for joining me on my little painting this is what i have so far i gotta wait till it dries so i can add more layers my little painting. Mama, wanna say bye? Mom says bye. Okay, I'll see you guys in another video. Bye.